today we're gonna go check out the mangroves. But it's not like every other mangrove tour here in Langkawi. We're going in kayaks and we're going deep into the mangrove. We're getting up close and personal with this incredible ecosystem. I don't know about you guys, but when we're going on a tour or any type of trip, we check for five star ratings, and that's how we found Extreme Langkawi on Google. With five stars across the board, we are for sure gonna have a great time, and we're really excited. Welcome, welcome to the Kilim Ju Forest Park. Off into the unknown for you. Farley said sometimes it gets people that are thinking it's the bat cave, but really it's the bat cave, the bats. So let's go. might be short, but I'm tall enough to have to duck for the caves. One thing to note, you don't want to touch your hand on any of the railings, because the bats poop and pee freely. So you're going to end up getting that poop and pee on your hands, then later you're going to wipe your face, and you're going to end up with all of that on your face. Don't forget your feet. <laughs> Time for the best part of the tour, kayaking. We are about to go through some dense mangrove forest where no other boat is gonna be able to go. We're gonna get up close and personal with some wildlife and truly understand how mangrove forests work. We've got our paddles, life jackets, and drive bags all provided by Farley. Let's go adventure. Passbox tried to get in the kayak. Let's see if he falls. <laughs> all the pressure. And then just plop in there. Yeah, hang it all done. We are all set. We've got our water bottle holders. We've got our dry bags. And now I've got a paddle. We're only about five minutes into the mangroves and you can't hear anything. You can't see, hear the boats passing or people yelling. It's just quiet. The only sounds around me right now are just like the humming of some birds and then like the occasional leaf falling. It's kind of eerie and creepy in here. And then of course, right at that same time, Farley went ahead and told me that there are venomous snakes. So let's see if we find any. But we've already seen some monkeys. Taking the kayaks is the only way to do this tour because on the boats, you're just kind of passing by. You don't get into the depth and see how crazy the mangroves are. natural barrier protecting the land from the harsh ocean swells. And between low tide and high tide, the water levels in a mangrove can change by three meters. So all the species that live in here have to be very adaptable. We're at the edge of the mangrove now, and so there's boats that are passing by, and so you can hear the waves that come through here. When you go back not even five meters, the waves stop. So you can see that the mangroves actually do their job, and they keep the water protected and calm, and this helps protect fish and other species. It gives them a perfect breeding ground. We're done with one jungle, and now on to another. Going backwards, Pat. Congratulations. <laughs> it's not fair because Maddie was brought up kayaking her whole life, so this uh -huh. is so easy for her. I do one thing that I think I'm cool. She's like, well, that's easy. <laughs> so fun fact about me, I grew up whitewater rafting and kayaking. When I found out that we got to go kayaking today, I was so excited. Each tree probably has I don't know, I want to say hundreds, but I don't know if it's that much, but each tree has so many roots going down into the water. And it's so interesting because some of them are really shallow. So when you're paddling, you just keep hitting their roots, which kind of like tree branches. It's a really interesting, unique experience. And it's so just peaceful and tranquil when you're in here. So one of the questions being asked to me from my guests is that Kwali, don't you ever get tired of doing this every day, looking at the same thing? Well, it is the same thing that I see every day, but making it uh, more animated or more colorful in a way is that I get to do it with different people. This is what I call a passion-driven business. 
where I'm into it not just for the money because if I want to get rich I might as well go into real estate or something like that this is my passion and this is why I do it look around you yeah welcome to my office this is it I hope you're having a great time doing this because this is not even halfway of what we're doing yeah my face when he just said that is in just complete shock. We've already done so much and learned so much. I can't wait to see what we've got next. Push that, not that way, Pat. Shit. <laughs> Hope everybody's getting this on film. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> You would make that look easy. I hate you. Over here at the eagle viewing spot, or known as the eagle feeding spot, most of the eagles are the Brahmini kite hawks, or plainly known as the brown eagle. So, the meaning of Langkawi goes back to the brown eagles, or the Brahmini kite hawks. Lang is the Malay word for eagle, and Kawi goes back to any ancient Sanskrit word that says brownish red color. Langkawi. We just saw some river otters on the edge of the mangroves. And with Extreme Lane Cow, you get a jump in the water. Ah! There's an eagle just flew right above my head. Wow. <laughs> oh, it's like a beached whale. So not only do you get to see the bat cave, go through the mangroves, see where the eagles are feeding, but you also get a full spread dinner of fish, rice, and it looks like soup. We're enjoying snapper, and it's ridiculously good because it is farmed right here. Literally taken out, cooked fresh, and put in front of you to eat. So if you want a really fresh seafood dish, this is the place. So I know that tour was gonna be worth it, but it completely exceeded my expectation. Farley is so knowledgeable. I don't think there's any other way to do that tour besides taking the kayaks. I highly recommend checking out the link in our description to book a tour with Farley. You can also find his WhatsApp number in the description. He's really easy and laid back and he'll make the tour so much fun. Welcome. We really appreciate it. So. Thank you so much. Let's Have a good out. one. <laughs> make sure you subscribe so you can see next week's video on all the best things to do in Langkawi. Cock-a-doo-doo! -doo!